Hey guys, it's me, Mr. Cheese Gaming here, and we'll get back to more of Let's Play Undertale Blind. Last time, we learned that Goat Lady here has a surprise for us, and hopefully it does not involve us getting eaten. Anyways, I've just been sitting here, and I... Lately, I've been thinking to myself, you know what this actually reminds me of? The music aside from... Of course, the Earthbound music. Especially this moment right here. The combination of pianos and 8-bit and chiptunes actually reminds me a lot of Pokemon. Especially the Pokemon games that went on for the 2000s. Pokemon, you know, specifically Pokemon Emerald and even Pokemon Platinum. Does add some trumpets and bells and yeah, it would be Pokemon music. Home. Well, I guess this is our new home, and I... Again, that character still looks nonchalant. I love it. Oh. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I actually wouldn't mind that. If you put some apples in there, I would probably... I would love it if you put apples in it. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. Well... Hold on, I celebrate my arrival, like, were you expecting me to come here, or... Did you... Yeah, you definitely whipped it up real quick. <laughs> Anyways, um... I've noticed that your shirt reminds me, is reminding me a lot of Sario from... Highly responsive to prayers. By the way, I hate that game. I want you to have a nice time living here. Well, thanks. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. I've actually never tried snail. I've tried... I tried oyster, and I like that. Here, I have another surprise for you. Side is an old counter from the beginning of 2001X. 21X. Should I say 21N? Is that a picture frame? Or a. They must have been read many times. Is that a picture frame or a mirror? Because that's pretty bad programming if that's a mirror. I don't see a reflection. This is it? A realm of your own. I hope you like it. Is something burning? Uh, make yourself at home. That better not be the pie. Oh, it's red. I prefer blue, but okay. It's flower. A box of good shoes and a despair. A disparity of sizes. Were you? Expecting someone to come in? <gasps> that is so cool! The music changes! That is so freaking cool! It's really dusty. Oh, I was. I thought I was looking at those pictures, okay. Can I check the closet? Hi. Look at these two guys. They don't interest you at all. That's that's oxymoronic. Father Scott's cinnamon pie. All I pee. You know what? I'm gonna be kind. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna waste it. I'll use it right now. And I'll go straight back to bed. See, 
I would have preferred this room because I kind of like blue. Toriel! Well, if you're gonna leave it open then. Nah. Not too nice of a guy. Scandalous. <laughs> Renovations. Well, it's morning, and it's time for breakfast yet? Oh, I might as well explore it. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could put your hand inside. So it's kind of like cold fire? Up already, I see. I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I get a feeling that you don't have any child don't get any children of your own. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. Huh, I heard that bug hunting is a popular sport in Japan. Or used to be before it got all urbanized. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still. That face she made. <laughs> I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? Be fair. This is actually a difficult decision for me that actually makes me want to think. I kid you not, because realistically, I wouldn't I wouldn't mind this situation. But thing is, it's also so new and I already have a life back home. This is actually a difficult decision for me. You know what? I have to ask. What? This... This is your home now. No. I'm sorry. Uh, would you like to hear about uh, this book I am reading? It is called... 72 uses for snails. How about it? Sure. Here's an exacting snail fact. Did you know that snails talk? Really? Slowly? Just kidding. Snails don't talk. Interesting. Yeah. Well, bother me if you need anything else. I'll have to exit the ruins. Slice of pie intimidates you. The size of the pie. <laughs> it's not that big of a pie. I stuffed them. Must use fire magic instead. There is a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. I'll explore the house a little bit more. History book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked, until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named... Home. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. Sorry if I laugh loudly, it's just that... It's kind of funny. I think you should play upstairs instead. She's a little... Okay. Let me be serious here. 
I, no, I am not joking. I would not actually mind. Back at this kid's age, assuming that this kid is not four, but rather say 12 or 13, I would not mind this situation at not really much. Because that's the thing. I wouldn't, if my mother was a goat, I wouldn't mind. She's really friendly, but the thing is, the thing is, she's not my mother. I mean, I can. I don't want to sneak out. I have to tell her. I have to tell her. I don't. I don't want to break your heart, but how to exit the ruins? I have to do something. Stay here. Seems all the right size for Toriel. Then the tools have been filed down to make them safer. This woman is very motherly. Well, I'm gonna assume that you're in your room. She's not in her room. Are you in the renovation room? No. My bedroom? No. Well, I'll just walk. Maybe the basement. There you are. You wish to know how to return home. Do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy... You can't keep me here forever. I'm s I'm sorry. No one will ever be able to leave again. Yeah, I have a feeling that you have some kind of dark backstory. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No, I'm sorry, but you can't. If a human that falls down here meets the same fate that they join you, I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. She's trying to protect me from the rest of the underground. I get it. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. Asgore, is that your king or something? I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. You have to understand. I know you're trying to protect me, but I need... You're not my mother. Do not try to stop me. I want... Look, if I want to live with you, it has to be at my free will. You can't keep me... This is just keeping me captive. I mean, if you want to keep me safe, escort me to the upper world. But... Go ahead and escort me to the upper world, but you can't... You just can't keep me captive. I'll go crazy. I'm serious. This is your final warning. I'm sorry. You need to be reasoned with. You want to leave so badly? <laughs> it's just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. I don't want to kill you. I'm gonna have to reason with you. Also, this is pretty cool music. Can't think of conversation substance. Whoa!
spare you? Interesting bullet pass. But Yeah, I got this bullet pattern. Ironically, tucking does not seem to be the solution in this situation. <laughs> I'm gonna keep trying. Ow. Ow! Take some deep breath. Please understand. Again. Ow! Ow! Ah, please. right go upstairs you know what I'm gonna end it here next time next time I don't know what to do if you like this video go ahead leave me behind a link leave behind a comment and subscribe to see more videos I'll see you next time where I'll continue this talk.